just gonna do a quick painting today. Maybe two. Just uh, to show you guys something that I was doing the other day. I have no real colors in mind, but I'm gonna collect up a couple of them and show you what I did. Start going. There's basically a couple of different versions compared wrapped into one style of painting. Um, I'll show you what I did and then try to see what I could do this time. I said nothing special. All this paint is mixed the exact same way as it I normally mix my paints, which is basically um, two, three parts blow trawl, um, one part paint. Everything is in my description below. That actually has a recipe. I can't remember offhand, but it's what works for me right now. Later on, I might end up changing it up. I'm not a hundred percent sure, but for now, that's what it is. So, basically, just pick different colors that you like and that you would like to have on here. Hopefully, ones that will work together, but if they don't, you know that for next time, and not to use those styles. You know, like I said, there's really no plan. Just gonna play around and see what we come up with. I started off just using red, blue, and yellow, which kind of created some few new colors since they were all mixed together. But I haven't made more of those yet, so now I'm just using all sorts of other random colors. The best thing about painting is that. You don't really have to worry as much about everything else. Um, your colors go where they want to go. And yeah, you can kind of help guide them, but they're still going to do what they do. So you don't really got to worry as much about, you know, like the actual brush paintings and such. I just don't have the patience to do all the the brush work. Look, that'll be my last color that I put on. From here, what I do, I just take the little, you know, whatever they're called, and muck it up a little bit. Just get the paints in different colors and different areas and such. And then just spend the fuzz out of it. I usually just keep spinning it until all the colors are mixed in the way that I would like. Uh, so a little bit more on that side. And just do like this a little bit. And we'll spin it again. If it doesn't work, then you will. Because I'm still seeing white as it's spinning. Then I'll add a little bit more paint in that area. And kind of let it go. Let it go just a little bit. As a matter of fact, trusty little blower. Let's help it along a little bit. So we could be done right there, but. I like to go one step further. Um, let's see. 
is a color that we did not use on there. And so what I like to do from here is take another color and we're going to use that that we just did as a background for a balloon. So this right here is where the two worlds combine and do one. Because normally it's one or the other on this side. But there's no fun in that. And I said with the rule or with art there are no rules. Don't really gotta worry. Uh, just a simple green and the pink because I think that they go pretty good together. And then I'm going to use a little white cell activator. Once again, the recipe is down in the description below. And so if you would like to see what I'm doing at the moment, check that out. And you can see how I make everything. No. Now we're just going to give it time to kind of combine all together, work its magic a little bit. Spray out right here and maybe right there just a little bit more. Now what we're going to do, it's been a little bit, as you saw, I had to help with a little bit in the middle. Um, but now, it's been enough. And see, then it uses the background color and kind of comes through and pops a lot more. I might spin it just a little bit more, see if I can get that side to go a little bit further and be done. Okay. 
this is only the second time that I've done this painting, or this style. I haven't fully worked out all the bugs yet, but I wanted to get a full piece in there just to show you guys, in case you wanted to try as well. But, let's see. And so, see, then the pinks and the lacing kind of comes through, and gives it a kind of neat little little look. Next time, I might actually pick my colors to see if I can get them to play a little bit more better, or better together. But for now, that is how it goes. So, give it a shot. See if you like doing it. And what colors you should come up with. If you feel like it, tag me if you want to. Have a great day. Bye.